ride through the Wissahickon Trail. Let's see where this leads me. Let's see, oh, this is the Lincoln Drive Trail. And it connects to Wissahickon. So let's see, the Lincoln Drive Trail. The Lincoln Drive Trail. That makes sense, it's the Lincoln Drive Trail, not the Wissahickon Trail. That makes sense. That makes sense. Oh, there's gonna be some branches that fall over because of the weather, huh? Do do do. 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 Wow. Look at the scenery over there. I should get my 360 camera back here. This is a 360 camera spot. I need the 360 camera. So much beauty back here. So much different than the hustle and bustle of Center City. It's nice to keep the, gear, uh, the pedal assist mode on one right now. It's a lot more quiet. It's a lot more quiet. Let me increase it though. I think there should be a really steep hill back here that I can try to ride up. Maybe I'll try to ride up a steep hill. Maybe I'll try that out. Woohoo! So fun! Yeah. I need a helmet. I need a helmet. This is a very fast and dangerous bicycle. I certainly need a helmet. I certainly need a helmet. I'm going to purchase a helmet. Here we go. Up and over. It's like a roller coaster back here. It's like a roller coaster ride back here. <laughs> Look at this roller coaster ride. This is a fun spot to bike. Let's see how the, the treads work. What is this called? The, uh, the fenders, right? Fenders, not treads. What am I even saying? I don't know anything about bicycles. I don't know anything about bicycles. I just like riding them. <laughs> Man, maybe I can flip the GoPro around. Oh wow, look. Look at this, we have a, we have a detour ahead. A tree has fallen. A tree has fallen. Oh boy, look. But this is a beautiful thing to see. I mean, I know it's a devastating sight, like a tree has fallen, but like these natural sort of disasters or natural sort of like occurrences, I don't know, it's kind of beautiful to me in a weird way. It's kind of beautiful to me in a weird way, I don't know. I gotta get under here though. <laughs> Let's see. All right. It's an adventure, you know? I kind of like that. I kind of like that adventure, you know? It's a cool little detour. You know, it's sad that we don't want trees falling over. We don't want them falling over, but we admire all of the beauty, everything that happens. The ups, the downs. I've seen trees fall over on this trail all of my life. Since I was a little boy biking back here, I, I would always see trees. I would always have to do that, you know, like go under the log. And I don't remember the tide being this crazy when I was a kid, though. But maybe it's always been like that. You know, the tide is pretty high. Or is it low? Low or high? How do you describe the tides? How do you describe the tides? Is it high tide? High tide, I gotta become a weatherman and make sure I'm accurate with my uh, predictions and stuff, you know? It's high tide today here in Philadelphia. Okay, so here's the, um, here's the hill. Okay, this is a hill that I can maybe try to climb. You know, maybe I could try to, look, I'm not. So I've got the gear on seven, the pedal assist at the max, and I'm just gonna throttle up. I'm not even pedaling. And it's, and it's cruising me up, I'm just, I'm just using the, uh, the full throttle. So now I'm noticing the uh, energy bars depleting a little bit. 
So that must mean when you go up hills, it, you know, it's, it's using a lot more energy. It's using a lot more energy, yeah. But hey, look, I'm getting up the hill so easily. Now we're off-roading a bit. It's a bit rocky. It's like a rocky path. But this is going to take me to the Wissahickon, I think. I don't know. I, I think this takes me to like some old buildings and stuff. Like there's so much stuff to discover back here. You know, there's a lot to discover. Like I see a trailhead and there's like two different paths. Look, I could go left. I could go right. I like being back in the woods. Wow, it's bumpy. I don't know that this is meant for off-roading this bike, but it's called the Expedition, so I'll assume it is, right? Look at these trails. There's so many different paths to take. And look at this building. What is this used for? This old building over here. I remember this. The Hermits of the Wissahickon. Wow, what is this? Let's see. Let's see. Let me get off the, uh, let's get off the bike. What did we discover today? Okay, what am I doing? <laughs> I forget that this is a step through bike. I need to use the, uh, the kickstand here. There we go. Kickstand activated. Is it stable? Yeah. So we have here the Hermits of the Wissahickon. In 1694, a small group of men left Germany in search of religious freedom, known as Piasts. They pursued interest in prayer, medicinal herbs, astrology, mathematics, alchemy, philosophy, and music. Johannes Kelpius, described as a mystic philosopher, led the Piasts. They settled in this area and became known as the Hermits of the Wissahickon. On this property, they reportedly worshipped in a tabernacle, erected log cabins, and meditated in the nearby cave. I remember finding caves back here when I was a kid. Hey, that's one of the caves. Look, I think this cave I've seen, I don't know if this exact one, but similar caves. I've seen similar caves back here when I was a kid. The group dissolves when, dissolved when Kelpius died in 1708, and members joined other religious organizations such as the Mennonites, Dunkers, and Seventh-day Baptists. The Richter or Ryder family acquired the property in parcels, amounting to 151 acres. Wow. They operated a ferry and a shad fishery on the banks of the Schuylkill River. Local place names such as Ryder Street, Ryder's Ferry Road, and Ryder's Mill Road mark lands once held by Peter Ryder and his descendants. Very interesting. I love my Jesus quite alone. I love my Jesus quite alone, the bride, the bridegroom of my spirit. No other shall my heart, none through love, through loving more inherit. No man can do at once for to her. Oh, I can't see the rest. <laughs> and I do not know how to sing. The magnet needle airing goes when from, when from the pole. The pole distracted and take before quite no repose till he, till he has her attracted. And since my heart with thy love dart is thatched, is touched by its flaming other. Oh, ether. Therefore they haste together. And though thou art like the North Star in heaven, in heaven, I'll. Alt. Alt. Altified. And I on earth so distant far, I'll fall, I'll follow you undenied. Still the my light and my eyesight shall still be turned up to thee from every place and woe thee. <laughs> okay, I seriously, I don't know how to like read the notes, you know, like how do you read uh, music? Perhaps. The preachers in church or the cantor will teach me. I don't. I don't know how to. Uh, I don't remember how to sing. But we we learned how to sing when I, you know, in church when I was a young boy. Hey, maybe I can go and check this out. At a, I don't know. Yeah, let's check it out. The Hermits of the Wissahickon. Let's check out the Hermits of the Wissahickon. Let's check out what this is. I think. Uh, I think it was uh, a good idea to come up here today, just to see what this is. Uh, 
and then I'll go and uh, ride back down the hill. This is quite nice. Maybe I'm allowed to walk around it? It seems like it's open to the public, you know? Maybe it's like a historic sort of thing. Sort of just pres preserved for the public now. Imagine living back here. Man, I wonder if people use this. I wonder if it's still active. This is quite cool. Hey, look, there are chairs. Man, this is such a beautiful place to be. I don't know if I'm trespassing. I feel weird being here, but hey, it's a, it's a beautiful thing to just come back and explore. I'd love to sit around these chairs and talk about life with somebody, right? This would be a good place to sort of uh, tell stories and uh, get away from the city. Hey, perhaps this is the new Fight Club location. Uh, secret street photography meetup group. Uh, <laughs> We can, we can become the hermits of the Wissahickon, the street photographers of Philadelphia, rise up. Let's become, a, <laughs> let's become hermits together. I would love to be back here. I mean, imagine the things you can explore back here. Where's that cave? Okay, where's that? I wanna see if that cave is over here. Where's that cave at? I wanna find the Native American statue. I wanna find all of the caves. I remember when I was a child, I would build teepees back here. Look, there's a staircase. I feel like this would lead to the cave, you know, but who knows? Hey, this is inspirational for me. Looking at this and learning about the Hermits of the Wissahickon, yeah, it gives me hope for the future. Maybe I can live in a house like this one day, right? Who knows? I think it's quite nice, you know, but maybe the condo life is better, the convenience, right? I would have to keep up with the property and make sure everything's tight and orderly. I think it would be a lot of work to have a house like this. <laughs> the Hermits of the Wissahickon.